hello everyone welcome back to my channel in today's video i'm going to be sharing with you guys six mistakes that i made when growing this plant because right now it doesn't look good at all and i really don't want you guys to make that kind of mistake so let's get started welcome back so the first tip i'm going to be sharing with you guys is to avoid overwetting your plant as you can see right here the plant is stunted and the leaves are yellowish it doesn't look attractive at all and that's because of overwetting you only apply water when your soil is dry and not when it is moist number two avoid excess fertilizer application if there isn't a foliar fertilizer avoid spraying your plant every week because excess fertilizer application leads to stunted growth and also if there isn't compost or dung you can as well mix it with your soil at the early stage while pairing your, your soil or you can apply it later on to your plants during the fruiting stage. Number three, don't skip adding off. Adding off is very important for the plant survival outdoor. So what you do is during the nursery stage, you expose your plants to sunlight for a few hours, then take them back in. You can do this for a few days before you transplant your plant outdoor. So this is very important for them to adapt to the sunlight before you finally bring them outdoor for growth. Number four, avoid plant stress. Plant stress could be as a result of change in temperature. So when there is a higher temperature, the best thing is to have a constant supply of water to the soil so as to help the plants adapt to the loss of water. And also when it comes to a cold temperature, the plant, pepper plant doesn't love a cold temperature. So the best to do to adapt to that kind of environment is to cover up the soil with straws or leaves to create a little bit of heat for the plant to survive on. Number five, the choice of soil is very important. You need to choose a rich soil and a loose soil. I always avoid using clogged soil because it affects the root development. So it's important to choose a loose soil for your roots to develop properly inside the soil. Number six, your plants can be stunted and look dull as a result of pest infestation. So the best thing to do is to check the back of your leaves frequently to identify this pest and clear them off as soon as possible before they damage your plant completely. I hope you find these few tips very helpful. If you do, please click the like and the subscribe button. See you guys in the next video.